Hello everybody, I'm going to do a review on a new episode of Rolling Girls, which is episode 10. Now, this episode was pretty stupidly ridiculous, like literally it was just, really just cracky, okay? Or, in other words, like, um, terrible. Because right now, I don't even know what the heck's going on. Like, we had this serious stupid drama going down, like, etc. So, if anything else, let's go. Okay, for Hibiki, Hibiki Ai, you know, she ends up being like, um beaten up and taken into a house and she's gonna do some hard labor for stealing some peaches etc as for you can have Kosaka she tries to help out trying to find like um um Hibiki Hibiki Ai probably Chiaya and Nozomi as well but you know like um, she ends up trying to help out trying to help a prisoner escape but later on it ends up being stupid to a point where she like um Tries to help the prisoner that she knows, probably, and ends up being in prison too. And I'm thinking in my mind, what the heck is with you? And I think there's another person who's been keeping an eye on Chiaya and the other girls for a while now. And she ends up being, and that person ends up being in in jail as well. Some fatso dude whatsoever. Momi, Momi, Yama, whatever his name is. As for Chiaya, you know, we end up knowing who she is at the beginning, you know, she's actually a little small octopus whatsoever that just landed on Earth and needs to get back home. As for Nozomi's problem, I think she came along to see some kind of bamboo shoots whatsoever, and there was a scene about like these two people want to get this octopus pot whatsoever, and I think in my mind, what's the point of having it, you know? And then, Nozomi, she ended up taking um, the owner's daughter or assistant, I don't know what her, what she is, I forgot, to, back to the shop, and we see to it that her father, or, I'm pretty sure it's her father, ends up, ends up getting beaten up, and she gets upset about this, and we see to it that her father is trying to say something, and Nozomi tries to stop her, you know, but she gets pushed aside really badly, and Nozomi, I'm thinking in my mind, what the heck are you trying to do, stupid B? Seriously. And then, another thing about, like, um, um, Utoku Masami, she ends up being part of a plan to return an octopus pot, I believe, and etc. As for Chiaya, she ends up being the octopus about to be cut cut to pieces for food, but lucky enough, she turns into a human after being distracted, after the girl distracted her mother with a dog, since she has a fear of dogs or something. I'm thinking in my mind, what the heck, man, what's going on here? And then, yeah, nothing much going on, super, it's like, yeah, I don't know. But all I know is just like, um, <sighs> it's not getting anywhere right now. All it does is ends with like um, her daughter that's fearful of dogs whatsoever, I don't know, decides to take on the woman head on to d reduce the taxes. And I'm thinking in my mind, well, isn't this going to be a fact? And as for Chiaya, she tells Hibiki Ai to try to like, um, make up, you know, she doesn't, um, no, Nozomi doesn't hate you anymore, and I think I might, Nozomi's a stupid bee, how about that, she doesn't even know what she's doing, and later on, I think she gets caught by one of them tax, tax payers that needs to get the taxes, you know, and right now, I'm thinking in my mind, girl, you really need to learn how to shut up nowadays, you know that, and I don't know what's gonna happen, but there's only two episodes left, and I want it to end really quickly, okay, um, I'm gonna end it here, people, um, I think my next review will be World Trigger, I believe. Hopefully that comes out today. Um, expect that one up anytime soon, maybe around like um, possibly from 3 to 5 o'clock at most, hopefully. So, yeah, I'll see y'all today. I'm out from zero. Have a good day, and I'll see you guys later, alright? Peace out. Bye-bye.